Yo, what is good everyone? My name is Mr. Bubbles A Pie, and welcome to another little TF2 live commentary. This time I decided to play some good old MVM. I haven't played this in a long ass time. So I decided to say, why the fuck not? Let's get to it. Oh no, I messed that up. So I'm just gonna be here talking to you guys, talking about uh because this is like yeah, like a couple hours right after Christmas. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about some Christmas. So let's talk about some Christmas, why don't we? I'm just, and I apologize if I do sound low toned. I, I'm just like super tired. And I had to be like, well, I was going out. I'm gonna go out later on today. And I wouldn't have enough time to upload or do a video. So I'm gonna do one now. And save, my, save myself the trouble and the uh, stress of the 26 people who wanna watch my videos now and then. So. Let's get on to it. Let's talk a little bit about Christmas go, go, while go. we wait for the rest of the team go, to go, get ready. Go. So I hope everyone had their own little wonderful Christmas or that or holidays, whatever you celebrated on this nice winter ass day. One thing I did want to talk about, I'm not sure where you are in the world, but for me, I'm in New York and like I'm assuming the further up north you are, the further away from the equator, further away from the equator, like the colder you'll get. And boy, this is the sunniest goddamn Christmas I ever seen in my life. This is like that Phineas and Ferb episode when they brought winter to fucking like the middle of July. So, when I woke up, I woke up, uh, I woke up pretty early because I was actually, I was actually pretty excited. I saw like a good couple of gifts for me and my little brother. Pretty excited, so I'm like, all right, wake up early. Woke up early, and so I'm like, okay. I'm like, I'm at a key of, okay. So I'm like, alright, sure. If you have so, I'm here like, alright, now we gotta, we gotta be like, alright, I'm up. Now I'm gonna wake up my little brother. That way I can use him as bait to wake up my actual mother. So, what I did was, well, since he was knocked out, I was like, you know, give him a little wiggle, wiggle, a little shake here and there. Give him a little shake. And, like, he wouldn't get up. So, I would have done, like, as the best responsible brother. I picked his ass, like, I lifted up his bed, and I, like, I dropped it down. So, by far one of my best ideas. And at first, he, like, he looked up and smiled when I said it was Christmas. And then, thank you. And then he was like, oh, rad, that's so cool. And then after, like he was like, uh, like he was so excited. Then like he just went back to sleep for some reason. So I'm like, uh, okay, he'll wait. He'll get back up, and he didn't get back up. So I'm like, oh shit, this man didn't get up. So my attempt is like that. I lifted up his bed twice as high, and then I dropped it again. So after his little, little adorable ass bounce that he did. He like finally woke up and realized what was going down like, oh, it's actually Christmas. Let me get up. So after he got up and I was like, alright, we're open your gifts. He's like, yeah, yeah, of course I do. And I'm like, okay, all you gotta do is like wake up your mom. And he's like, you're sure? So like like honestly when it comes to like you know how it is. Like when your parents are your parents would be like you know like awake once in a while your parents would be cranky but your parents are like most cranky when fucking you know they're asleep and you wake them up for like no reason at all so like it's like it's like at first i'm missing them all each other. and God. it goes from like an angered woolly mammoth to like a fucking lord beerus from dragon ball z and you decide to be like the retarded Goku to say, you know what, you're a god, I'm gonna fight you. And like, you're, you'll be that guy. So, that, that's something I didn't want to do. Since like, I was older, I feared that like, I would get more of a, a repercussion. Like, you know, like, I feel like if I woke her up, I feel like she killed me faster than she would with my little brother. Cause you know, you're young, he's like nine. And so, so he's younger, he's like, he's cuter. And he has more, he has more innocence in his eyes than I do. So, so I would just, uh, oh. Okay, so 
So it's normally just be like, okay. So he shoved off. He went to go knock on the door. And mom came out, ready to go. And she wasn't ready. She, she was like, you know, like fucking, like good old like 1950s mom with the fucking. Oh. Well, that was unlucky. Let me, let me be a soldier. The, he was like the good old 1950s mom with the uh, with the um, what's that? What's that shit you call? Ah, what was it called? Bathroom? Like sleeping robe or something like nightgown, something of the sorts, like all hair messed up and whatnot. And she was like, "What you wanted?" And it's like, "Oh, I want to open up the gifts." And it's like, "Oh, well." And mom was like, oh, sure, you can open up your gifts after I get up. Because we had like a little rule in the family to where if when it came to, when like when it came to like opening presents, it's like you cannot open up anything unless the whole family's up. Like the whole family has to be awake, the family got to see you so we can like record it and, you know, put it on Facebook or like save it as a memory and whatnot. So like, all right, you respect that. So I tried to wake him up and after like she didn't wake up so like I had to stay up like a good couple of hours doing like fuck all nothing and while everyone else was asleep. I just couldn't go to sleep. So I just didn't want to go to sleep and whatnot. Oh, I remember. So the day before Christmas we had a chance to open up our gifts but my uh, my little brother threw like he, he blew it. So when I woke up Christmas Eve Everyone thought it was Christmas. It's still like I'm here, like all right, it's Christmas Eve, it's whatever, da 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 da. And my little brother, my mom, like everyone thought like it was it was Christmas. So my little brother was like, oh, it's Christmas. And it's like, oh no, it's not. It's just Christmas Eve. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. whatever. Carry, I carried on. I went to use the bathroom. And then when he walked, and then uh, my little brother walked into my my mom's room. Yeah, yeah. He. Thanks. Not he, uh, my mom was all excited, like, oh, it's Christmas, and Merry Christmas, and the League, et cetera, et cetera. And in my head, I'm like, yes, this is my opportunity. This is the opportunity for my little brother. The first time in his life, he could lie. And he could just claim, claim the present. We all have a fun time. And he was like, no, 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 it's just Christmas Eve, Mom. And now most people are like, oh, that's good. That's a good job. He didn't lie. But in my head, I'm like, fuck, you blew it. It was the one chance I had. Oh, well, time went on. I got my gift. Um, so, just to tell you, most people did not really care. My my loving and caring mother bought me a um, a blue snowball, a blue, a blue snowball microphone. And that's what I'm using now for this recording. So I really like this, uh, I really like the microphone, it's like a major setup, I'm glad to, like, this is like a one good step in, into the, uh, future of my equipment, cause, I just really, cause I stopped, oh fuck, it means it's on. I stopped using, um, my webcam, cause the webcam I would use were the ones for my, uh, microphone. I mean, one for my laptop, excuse me. And I realized, like, yeah, this kind of looks shitty. So I'm not going to use it. So, so until like, I get like a, a better camcorder, that's what I'll use. So in the meantime, I'll just use, I'll just stick with this microphone and carry on. You know, I'll put up some pictures and whatnot, like what they are, and whatever. So it's a really good microphone. I, it's really nice. I like the way it sounds. All I think is it was like the fucking the uh, the snowball looks like the size of a fucking like diabetic Dragon Ball or some shit. Um, yeah, so it's like it's like the main thing. It's like it's like really kind of worrisome. I don't know if there's like any way I can carry it besides like the box it gave me in. I did find it pretty fucking funny that on the box it said. Um, Skype certified, which made me laugh. It gave me a good little chuckle. It, it actually made me, it made me want to like go 
and uh, Skype like one of my friends and be like, do I, do, I, do I sound clear? Do I sound certified? Do I sound clean enough to you, good sir? And they said, yeah, you sound nice. You sound whatever the same. My good old same old same old. Uh, so, no big deal. Not much of a problem there. So, little bro got some. Uh, got he got the last guardian, which is which is a game that I personally myself I really wanted to play because I was oh, yeah, yeah, tiny box too. Yeah, whoopee, got him. So he I think he got, he got like the last guardian, and, like some uh, holes and whatnot. Like I know for a fact, I always wanted to last, like because I like I mainly play all my games on the computer because I don't have any um I don't have any uh, like recording softwares to record on consoles. But my little brother, on the other hand, like he, well he doesn't have any of that either. But it's the fact that like he has a uh, he has a uh, fucking. So like he doesn't have anything to record like his record on his console, but still, like I really want to play Last Guardian because Shadow's Colossus was like such a great game. I'll, I'll say yeah, you know what, I'll say that probably for another video, to where I'll uh, I'll talk about I'll talk about like upcoming games because it's looking really it look it's looking pretty good. I'm not gonna lie to you, with some of the games I've seen, hopefully they don't let me down with the uh, with the games they've been showing here and there. But I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I'm pro it's probably just gonna be just one way for the video. I want like some fucking 20 long, 20 long ass minute video. Me just rambling on. I could do that. Yeah, I probably won't. I'm super tired. And, uh, oh, one thing I did want to announce that since the, uh, Steam sale, Steam Winter sale came out, you already know my, my bank account's like empty more than a motherfucker. More empty than a goddamn Grand Canyon. More empty than a fucking space itself. So, what I did, what I did was, was, uh, um, what I did was, was, uh, that I bought. I'm a huge, I'm a huge fan of Telltale Games. And after they announced the release of okay. Walking Dead Season 3, I, I bought them all. I, I, I bought every last Walking Dead one. I bought every last Walking Dead Telltale game. Mainly for the reason being is because. Get to an upgrade station. Oh, we have two scouts and we can collect all that money. Man, I'm disappointed. Let's go. Is that uh Fuck, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh piss, I actually forgot what I was talking about. Fuck. Uh, I was talking about Oh fuck. Well, that memory's long gone. I could just end the video here, not even knowing what I said. Damn, back there again. Uh, oh yeah, I remember now. I was talking about the Walking Dead Telltale series. So, the thing was right because I watched the Rad Brad play and beat, play and beat the first season. I I, I love the Rad Brad. One of like my first people, like first YouTuber that I ever subscribed to. I still watch his videos. Really cool guy. I'll you know what? I'll leave his uh, link in the description below because he's a, he's a super cool dude. Even if like I don't know, like I put in like bigger YouTubers in my book. My description. Not a lot of people are gonna click it anyways, but I do not care because he's such a cool guy. Um, season two, I have asked season two. I played like I think episode one and two on my PlayStation Vita, and I didn't buy like the rest of the fucking episodes. And season three, well, season three is here, and I want to fucking play it. I also bought the, the Telltale series of Borderlands, Tales of, from Borderlands. That's another thing I wanted to play. And I'm super hyped for that. Like I am uber hyped to play that. So yeah, because like there's certain games I always want like wanted to play, but I didn't like I really 
I didn't want to be spoiled if I couldn't like afford it, if I couldn't play it on my computer. Like Bioshock Infinite, I bought on my, one of my old computers and it couldn't run it worth shit. So I'm like, fuck it, I'm not going to play this until I get a better computer. Three, four years later, I finally got one and here I am Man, with a YouTube channel, Twitch streams and whatnot. So yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much how my Christmas went. Leave a comment below like how your Christmas went, any cool Christmas stories. I'm still trying to contemplate if I should like, you know, have all the waves in here. Yep. Eh, it won't be it probably won't be as fun. You won't be as many good highlights. I'll probably get more and more tired, more and more crowded. Uh, also about some new games that I plan on I plan on playing for uh, my channel that should be added to the color. Oh no, my streak. Unlucky. Well, I think I'm gonna just end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe. I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you all later. Merry goddamn Christmas. Peace.